All right, right now we've got a 2012 Crossroad Slingshot. It's a 290 BH. Guess I'm gonna go uh, do a quick video once over with you here, just so you can kind of see it. I know you're from a distance away. It does have a power tongue jack on it. Obviously you got your propane bottle in here. Battery box there. Um, from an outside standpoint, I mean, it's great. I haven't seen any any issues with it that I can call upon you. Outside shower. Wide stance. Looks like you got some aluminum rims on there. Decent tire tread. Alright, I'll swing you around. It did just stop raining out here, so. That's the back of it. Nice tire cover. Water heater. I guess if I was being picky, you got a few scrapes along the side here. But it doesn't look like there's any damage to it. Uh, maybe the biggest thing of note would be it looks like they got this awning held on with some pretty interesting contraptions. So, for whatever reason, it probably worked better that way when they did it, but just wanted to point it out. Um, main bedroom. Decent size. Looks like you got a spin around TV in here which is nice obviously a big stereo um, the only issue that I am aware of with this unit is going to be you're going to have some ripped up fabric in it essentially it's not the end of the world but it's not a hundred percent perfect either But other than that, nice LED accents, nice decent dark wood, storage. Obviously you get the slide so it opens up a lot more room in here for you. A lot of counter space. I mean for an RV, especially a travel trailer, I mean there's a, there's a ton of counter space right there. Fridge and freezer, rear bed, bunk. Obviously the, the bathroom area, medicine cabinet, looks like they've got some LED lights in there on top of it, skylight, fan above here, and then it looks like here you've got some more storage too. I mean overall it's a great unit. The only thing that I can count or call out on it like I said is going to be the fabric there and obviously I've went through and kind of showed you what it looks like this is probably the worst spot if you're handy you can take care of it great um, if not I always bring it in somewhere and they can handle it for you so if you have any other questions please let me know even looks like it has a rain sensor on it